I'm Carol Claybeck, and you're joining me for a virtual home party with us for children's books. So I'm going to focus right now on preschool books up to about first or second grade. We'll cover um, baby, infants, and toddler books, uh, picture books, activity books, and then some reading uh, books to get your kids started when they when they begin reading. So let's start with the babies and toddlers. This is um, an example of our touchy feely books. Usborn's kind of known for these books. This is. That's Not My Monkey, and we have about 25 books in this series. That's Not My Dolly, That's Not My Princess, That's Not My Prince. These are all high contrast images, lots of tactile um, things. That that's Not My mon Monkey, His Tail is Too Velvety, and every page has a different type of texture to it. These books are $8.99, and they're, they're great for infants, nine months and up. The next Touchy Feely book, and this is my personal favorite, this was just introduced in 2013, it's Baby's very first Touchy Feely Lift the Flap book. We also sell this without the flaps, and so if your child likes to tear things up, you can, you can go for that option. My son loves these at restaurants. He's two now, and I introduced these at 18 months. So who's hiding? There's the elephant. Very high contrast. There are um, little holes to put their fingers in, um, tactile things to touch, and just wonderful book. This one's $12.99. I highly recommend this one. Um, I also want to point out our very first words book. Some people overlook these. We have about six in this series. This is the bedtime book. I love this because as your child's learning their vocabulary, they can point to the picture and, um, and learn the word. And these, again, are high contrast um, scenes that your child will understand getting ready for bed and bath time. This book is $6.99. Another favorite at our house are the Max and Millie. And Max and Millie have four books in this series, and they all deal with life skills. So um, Max and Millie start school, Max and Millie go to bed, brush your teeth, Max and Millie, and take turns, Max and Millie. A lot of my clients with two and three-year-olds tell me that these books really help in getting their kids to understand how to share and get ready for bed. So these are great, Max and Millie, for your two and three-year-olds. These are our big book um, series. I love this because... It's great for, you know, beginning around three. My two-year-old can play with it, but it's really better for a three-year-old. And see, it's a fold-out picture, giant pictures. Um, so the little ones like the big pictures. And then as they get older, there's all these great facts. This one's about animals. So it's, it's just a good family book um, for children ages three to about seven. Great nonfiction as well. We have um, the big book of big animals, big bugs. Uh, we have Big Machines and the Big Book of Trains and, and a few other titles. This is uh, $14.99, and I recommend this for preschool as well. Moving on to picture books, um, this is an example of our Pipkin. We have a collection of these as well. And Pipkin is a penguin who asks really tough questions. So he asks, how high is the sky? How deep is the sea? How big is a million? How big was a dinosaur? And what I love about these books is not only the characters of Pipkin, but also the fact that each book comes with a pull-out poster, a wall-sized poster that, it, that illustrates the point that they're trying to make. These are sold as a set for $49.99, and each individual book is $10.99. Before we made this clip tonight, we read this book to our son, our two-year-old, would love Monkey Friends. This is a favorite. Monkey went for a walk one day and met some friends along the way. Monkey said, how are you, when he met the hidden kangaroo. Here's the kangaroo. And what's great about this book is the rhythm, the timing, the wonderful illustrations, and then it also has a puzzle, so you have to look for the animal. So this is Monkey Friends. It's $14.99, and it's in the Kane Miller part of the catalog. I want to talk for a minute about our activity books. So starting with preschool, these are very popular. These are our white clean activity books. Um, as your child's learning uh, to, do their, to write their alphabet, um, to write their numbers, we have one, two, three. Each of these is $7.99. The dot to dot is really popular as they learn finger and pen control. And these all come with a reusable pen. It's ready for writing and telling the time. These can come as a set as well. So check, that, check out the catalog for those set prices. I get a lot of requests for activity books for preschoolers. And we've got some great selections. These are some of our best sellers. Um, these are the wipe clean books. This is for early pen control and learning to write. This is white plain alphabet. We have one, two, three. Um, there are so many selections here. There's dot to dot. This is really good for pen control. 
and then we've got ready for writing and telling the time. These are $7.99 a piece, and they do come in collections of sets. And there's a few more titles available on the website in, their, in our catalog that you can check out as well. I love this title called The Little Boy's Activity Book, and this was new in 2013. We also have a little girl's activity book, and this is really um, new for the four to seven age group. This is just a really wonderful activity um, collection of mazes, coloring pages, sticker pages, lots of things to do to keep your child busy. It also comes under the title, The Little Children's Travel Book. So I'd, I'd suggest you check this out, ages four to seven. And then for ages eight and up, we have the girls and boys activity books, as well as just the children's activity book. We have doodling books and coloring books as well that you might be interested in. <clears throat> People ask about sticker books all the time. We've got some great selections. Um, this is an example of a three-year-old sticker book. Um, this is called Build a Picture, and the topic is trains. We also have Build a Picture Tractor and some other themes. Really good boys' choice for sticker books. And there's the um, images of the trains. If you just pick a um, train scene, there's a steam locomotive, and you would put the stickers on the corresponding page. And another boys' sticker book is um, sticker dressing heroes and then um, the girls sticker books we have a whole line about 14 sticker books called sticker dolly dressing and this one's um, princesses but we have fairies and pop stars and travel dolls and all sorts of things and there are 400 stickers in this book and the boys line there's 200 stickers um, I also get a lot of spotter book requests. This is 1001 Animals to Spot. We have several books available in this 1001 Things to Spot. So let's look at what that looks like. Um, so this is what one of the pages looks like here. And it tells you, you know, look for 10 what they call shrews, five foxes, two badgers, nine blackbirds in this forest thing. So this is an animal um, spotter book. <clears throat> 